Okay, so finally, in the description of my video, I have a link to everything you'll need. Uh, first off, you'll need to click the click the link to the Amiibos app, or you can search up Amiibos in the App Store, but you need to download this app, and it'll look like this. You can click the link in the description, or you can search up I -M, I mean A-M-I-I-B-O-S-S, -S. and once you're on this screen, go ahead and download it. Click that thing like four times. And once it's downloaded, that's whenever, this is the app that lets you ride uh, the NFCs, which are the Amiibos. Once it's downloaded, go ahead and open it. And it'll bring up this screen right here. So you can either pay $3.99 to raise the limit to buy 15, which will give you 15 rights. Or you can do what I did and pay $9.99 for the premium and get unlimited rights. So since I've already paid, I'm gonna go ahead and restore my purchase. You don't want to pay, there's a little X up in the top corner you can click. In the description of my video, there's a link to the Amiibo bins. All you need to do is click that link and it will take you to this Google Drive folder. Once you're in this Google Drive folder, you'll see Essential Files. Click Essential Files. It should be the very first one. It's got an exclamation mark, Essential Files. Click that folder. Then you'll see all of this. You need to click the Amiibo bin dot 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 zero nine underscore oh five dot zip. Brings up this. Click download, which is right up here in the top right corner. Give it a second. And then click download again. And then down here in the bottom left corner. You'll see a circle with a blue, I mean a, circle, a blue circle with an arrow. Click it, click downloads, and then you'll see the Amiibos, Amiibo Bins zip file, 2024-905. All you gotta do is click it, and it'll bring you in here into your folder on your files app. And inside of your files app, all you gotta do is click the zip, and then you get this file. Once it's extracted, all you need to do now. Let's go back to the app. You'll see import key file. You're gonna click browse, downloads, and then you'll see Amiibo bins. Don't click the zip. You need to click the Amiibo bins folder. Then you're gonna go to essential files. Click key underscore retail dot bin. And now you can import your Amiibo files. So you go to collect it now. See this up in the top corner, this little page. Click it. Click browse. Downloads. Amiibo bins. And then you can select whatever bins you want. If you want Animal Crossing, you can open it up. You can go into cards, select which ones you want. But I don't have Animal Crossing unlocked. I tried to. I wanted to get this video out, so we're going to do it this way. Uh, I've got Super Mario Galaxy, so I'm going to go down here to Super Mario, which is right here. And I'm going to import the gold and silver Super Mario. So there's gold. And there's silver. You just select which ones you want. Then you click open. And then you'll see them there. Now you can write them. I'm going to show you how to use the Flash Shibo with this, since it's a lot easier. So what you do is you just press this button in the middle. A little blue light comes on. And then you find which one you want to flash. So we'll use the gold one. It'll bring this up. And then all you do is click right to NFC. It'll pop up this little screen here. Then you take your flash shibo and hold it to the top corner. And it's written. I will also show you how to flash the NFC cards. So you go back to collected. You see, I'm going to use the Silver Mario this time. So what we'll do is we'll click Use. You'll see Right to NFC. And you hold it right there. And now you have an Amiibo on a flashcard. You have the Silver one on here, and we have the Gold one on here. Now if you want to, you can also go back. Like say, for example, you wanted to do Animal Crossing. We'll go here. To the little page, browse, downloads, amiibo bins, animal crossing, 
and you have there's so many Animal Crossing amiibos. So we'll go to the figures, and you'll see all of the figures. So you can either select all of them by pressing that, or whichever one. I'm just going to click a, cl click a few, and then we'll go to open, and then you have them all in there, and you can ride them the same way. So yeah. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it was, you know, educational. Hope it learned you something. Hope this is a lot easier to understand than most other things. Hope it's a little bit easier than my last video. But yeah, super easy. And as you can see up here, you can get the Flash Evo through the app. Okay, so the reason I wanted to make the video and include the Flash Evo was because last time I had a lot of people write me tell me that their NFC cards that they bought didn't work. And at first I thought it was their app. I thought maybe they were messing something up or, you know, user error. But come find out it was because Amazon lets their sellers, you know, misinform people on what actual cards are being sold. A lot of the cards will say that they are one type when they're not. So you never know if you're getting the right type. You may get the right type. You may be unlucky. But that's why with these, you don't have that problem. It always works. You know that it works. It's made for it. So you don't have the problem. And I definitely recommend it. I will also leave a link in my description. But I'm going to go ahead and explain real quick. you got to write one at a time with this one, which means it's reusable. And with this one, you can store multiple ones on. I'm going to make a video on the Flash Evo Pro very soon. I just wanted to get this one out. And I figured most would be more interested in the FOB because it's the cheaper version.